At this point, I'd like to introduce Senator David Le State Rep. David LaBuff and State Rep. Dan Donahue to present the citation from the legislature. Thank you, Councillor. It's so great to be here again uh, with this wonderful congregation to honor and recognize the incredible work your pastor has done over the last two decades. We can't thank you enough. And as the last servant said, you have worked hard. And it's time to take a long rest. But I know we'll be working continuously for the community. And we're happy to be here. And I'm here with Representative David LaBuff. And we're proud to present on behalf of the Massachusetts House of Representatives uh, a citation uh, in, recommend, in recognizing the hard work of, of our pastor. Thank you, Dan. And uh, Apostle Grace, thank you for all your decades of service here to the community and to this city. And as they say, you may be going into retirement, but the work of God and the work of Jesus Christ never ends. And we know that you will be here in our community. So I'd like to present to you from the Massachusetts House of Representatives, be it hereby known by the Massachusetts House of Representatives, that we offer our sincerest congratulations to Apostle Peter and Grace Aponsa in recognition of your retirement after 24 faithful years in service. The entire membership extends its very best wishes and expresses the hope for future good fortune and continued success in all endeavors. Offered this day, the 25th of July, 2021, signed by Representative Donahue, myself, and Speaker of the House, Ron Mariano. Congratulations. Thank you, Senator Moore. It's my honor and privilege to be here this morning to celebrate in Peter and Grace's uh, retirement. On behalf of the mayor of the city of Worcester who couldn't be here this morning, Councilor Wally and myself are here to present to Apostle Peter and Ponza. It is my dis distinct pleasure to present you with the key to the city of Worcester. In recognition, in recognition of over 20 years of service to the Church of Pentecost USA and for living a life of faith and service. Over the course of your life, you have lived in the highest traditions of Jesus Christ-like legacy. Your work of faith has led to improvements in the spiritual health of our city and through a leading life of service. Mayor Michael J. O'Hara began the key to the city program in 1924 and designed an intricate and beautiful key. I'm proud to have been able to recreate his original design and assistance from everyone involved in the machine technology program right here in Worcester at Worcester Technical High School and the Worcester Historical Museum. In recognition of your years of dedication, to your congregation in honor of over two decades of spiritual leadership, it is only right and fitting that you receive our city's highest honor. Congratulations on this well-deserved recognition. Thank you, Senator Moore. Yeah. 
It's my honor and privilege to be here this morning to celebrate in Peter and Grace's uh, retirement. On behalf of the mayor of the city of Worcester who couldn't be here this morning, Council Wally and myself are here to present to Apostle Peter and Ponza. It is my dis distinct pleasure to present you with the key to the city of Worcester. In recognition, in recognition of over 20 years of service to the Church of Pentecost USA and for living a life of faith and service. Over the course of your life, you have lived in the highest traditions of Jesus Christ's -like legacy. Your work of faith has led to improvements in the spiritual health of our city and through a leading life of service. <laughs> Mayor Michael J. O'Hara began the key to the city program in 1924 and designed an intricate and beautiful key. I'm proud to have been able to recreate his original design and assistance from everyone involved in the machine technology program right here in Worcester at Worcester Technical High School and the Worcester Historical Museum. In recognition of your years of dedication to your congregation in honor of over two decades of spiritual leadership, it is only right and fitting that you receive our city's highest honor. Congratulations on this well-deserved recognition.